New year, new me. Watch me turn into a completely different person in this video. Hey guys, it's Julia. Welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new here. So since it's a new year, I decided new year, new me, and that means we're going to be doing a complete glow up. If you're not already subscribed to my channel, make sure you subscribe and hit the bell notification button so you never miss another one of my videos. I post a new video every Saturday at 3 p.m. EST, 12 p.m. PST, and give this video a big thumbs up if you're feeling like you need a glow up. Anyway, I'm going to be completely changing my hair, doing my eyebrows, completely changing these nails, changing up the wardrobe, that means new outfits, a new way of doing my makeup, and some new jewelry which leads me to the sponsor of this video Anna Luisa and I'm actually wearing some Anna Luisa earrings right now so if you guys are not already familiar with Anna Luisa they are the best luxury jewelry brand that is not only sustainable but they're also affordable so I ordered three pieces of jewelry from them that came in these really cute little bags that are made of recycled material and even their packaging as you can see is sustainable which we love because we're trying to preserve this earth so the earrings that I have in right now they're called sparkle and they are 14 karat gold plated over sterling silver. I really love that this brand uses real metals that are all nickel free and 100% hypoallergenic. I really appreciate that because my ears get super irritated and infected if I don't wear 14 karat gold or sterling silver. I've been wearing these earrings for the past few days and they're so comfortable. I literally forget that I'm wearing them because they're so light. The next pair of earrings I got were these. They are called the Lulu and they're really cool because they're not like your typical earring with a back or a huggy. You actually put this little pointy part through your ear and then pull it all the way through through and then they're in and they're just danglies. I love how cute they are and these ones are only $59. I think these ones are $75 but they're doing a really cool sale right now where if you buy one you can get the other 40% off. The next piece I got is a necklace and this one is so cute. It's very snake like. It is called the Ina. This necklace is also $75 and it's 14 karat gold over stainless steel. I love this so much. It's gonna look so good with whatever outfit I choose at the end of our glow up. Leave me a comment down below letting me know which earrings you think I should wear at the end because I'm having trouble deciding. I just think it's really cool that this brand is 100% carbon neutral and uses recycled materials whenever possible. I don't know of very many luxury jewelry brands that do this and still have affordable prices. So if you're interested in getting yourself or someone you love some new jewelry up to 40% off, click the link below and check out Anna Luisa. Now let's go ahead and get into the glow up. Okay, so first things first, I need to get a haircut. So does my mom. Took a little TJ Maxx detour. This TJ Maxx has a bunch of designer stuff on sale. I'm looking for some winter boots and I don't really see any that I like. I'm about to go get my nails done. I'm headed to the nail salon. So these are the nails that I currently have. They're my New Year's nails. I love them so much. They actually stayed on a really long time. It's like been a month since I've got my nails done and usually they lift by now. And then here are the inspo nails. So I think I want to do like the light pink red heart. I also have red toes right now. I got a vegan Nutella latte and it's so good. So it is the next day since I got my nails done. I got a few things in the mail I want to show you that I ordered for this glow up. I've been having a really rough week. It's Mercury retrograde. Great. <laughs> It's Mercury retrograde, and I feel like everything that could go wrong has go gone wrong. But anyway, we have some awesome packages that came in the mail, so I want to show you guys what I got. First thing, I already opened it. I got this vegan lash and brow lamination kit. I already kind of opened it a little bit because I was super curious. It is these colored contact lenses. And here I have the best teeth whitening strips. Next, I did not order this for the glow up, but Dermalogica sent me a package. Ooh. Ooh, new awakening peptide eye gel we love next we have a package from my friend Vivian she's just super nice and sent me some soaps from her family soap business called Watto soap here we go oh she wrote a cute note I'm gonna link it down below so you guys can check it out oh, it smells so good I love it oh thank you Vivian and next we have the new clothes that I got Ta-da! this big bag from pretty little thing I like how it has a handle I got all this for really cheap it was like 80% off everything plus like 30% more off because I found a coupon code. We love a deal. Let's try this stuff on. First off, love the top. I'm not wearing a bra and I'm too lazy to put one on. Here it is. I also got it in black and then I 
love these pants. They're so comfortable. They fit me in like the waist and butt perfectly, but they're too long. Not a huge issue because I could probably just head in them. Here are the pants. They're so classy. I just tried on the same sweater, but in black. I don't know if I like it as much in black. I feel like there's like a weird thing here and here. Here are the like silky pants. They fit so well. They're not as long as the other ones, but they're still too long. Okay, I love this shirt. I've been looking for a black turtleneck crop top that's just like solid for a while. I have like a similar one from Revolve, but it's a little longer and I feel like the turtleneck is like too tight, but this is perfect. And then for the pants, I don't know if I like them. I think I might return them. I just don't feel like they fit that great in the waist here. They are. So maybe I'll get another pair of the other ones in a different color. I also feel like the crotch is kind of long. Now we have one more sweater to try on. I like it, but I just think it's too big. This one I'm definitely gonna exchange for a smaller size because I feel like there's just too much fabric. Alright, so I just got to the hair salon. I'm about to get my hair dyed. We'll see how it turns out. I'm so excited. Here's the finished hair. I feel like I need to show you guys in the house. It's hard to see in this lighting. I think it's like a cinnamon. We kind of kept like my brown and then we did like reddish highlights. I look so Hollywood. I'm gonna be trying to laminate my brows. I got this kit off Amazon. It's a vegan slash cruelty free lash and brow lamination kit. I think we're just gonna do the brows because I wanna do false lashes. I've literally never done this before, so we're just gonna see how it goes. Here's what comes in it. We have the tools, some stickies, Ooh, a little spoolie type of brush thing. Well, I guess these are spoolies too. All the chemicals and stuff for the lamination. Let's do this. So these are the finished brows. I don't know how well this really worked. Like I can't tell if it's gonna stay like this cause I had to sort of use the spoolie to push them up after I took the product out. They didn't like automatically go up, but normally they do fall down after and they didn't fall down. So it probably worked, but we'll see how it is when I put on my makeup tomorrow. What do you guys think? I have pretty sparse brows to begin with. I don't know if the feathered look is even really my best look, but my brows always look better when I fill them in anyway. Okay, so now it's time to white my teeth. These are called Burst White Strips. I get them on Amazon, they're linked down below. They're literally the best whitening strips I've ever used. They're made with coconut oil or something. And I have very sensitive cavity prone teeth and they do not hurt my teeth at all. And I feel like they make my teeth pretty white. Here are my teeth before. They're like not the whitest. I drink like a decent amount of coffee. These really help. We only need to keep them on for 10 to 15 minutes. So since the shirt I decided to wear is the turtleneck, I'm gonna actually put it on before I do the makeup so that way I don't get makeup all over the neck of the shirt. Ta-da! So before we do the makeup, I thought it'd be really cute to go ahead and add the Ana Luisa necklace over the turtleneck of the shirt because I think black gold necklaces like this with a black turtleneck just look so cute together. What do you guys think? Before we get into the makeup, let me pull these off. It's been about 15 minutes. I'm gonna like scrub off like the leftover residue real quick with my toothbrush. Okay, so here are my teeth. They definitely look a bit whiter. Anyway, let's go ahead and get started with the makeup. So my inspiration for today's makeup is gonna be like the fox eye look. Something similar to this picture. It's not gonna be exactly like hers, but I definitely wanna follow the super winged liner look with like the little point in the inner corner. You might add some freckles. Let's go ahead and get started with the makeup now. Also, I totally forgot, but these are the finished eyebrows the next day. I did brush them up. They stay up on their own after I brush them, but they don't just literally like stay up. Anyway, let's continue with the makeup.
I don't know how I feel about the brows. We'll see after I put on the rest of the makeup. They're very thick for me. And I don't know if I like it because I feel like they look like furry caterpillars. Almost forgot I wanted to do tape for the liner, but I might need it for some of the eyeshadow. So we're gonna put some tape on real quick. And this is the finished makeup. And now it is time for some colored contacts. I found them online, saw that a lot of makeup artists use them, so I was like, let's try it out. But these are the contacts. And if I'm not mistaken, I think they're like a bluish green color. Hopefully I remember how to put contacts in. I haven't used contacts since I was in high school or middle school. Well, I used color contacts for some videos in high school, but I used to actually have prescription contacts in middle school. But they were such a like pain to put in my eyes that I eventually stopped wearing them. So then I was supposed to wear my glasses but they hurt my ears and I gave up on both and I just try to see with my eyes the way they are everyone in my family basically has glasses I'm the only one who doesn't wear her glasses although I should but let's put these in so it comes with a little carrying case I think you can reuse them a few times actually I'm gonna try to pour this liquid into here so I can like save the liquid maybe I'll just try to put these in and like check back with you after Oh my god, I can't believe I just did that, but I got it on on the third try. It wasn't on camera, but it's on. Ask me if I can see. Not well. <laughs> How do people wear these? Maybe my pupils are bigger than the hole or just like not fully on correctly. I don't know, but my eyes look really cool. What's that called when somebody has one brown eye and one like blue eye? It starts with an H. Okay, I got this one in on the second try. Go me, I'm surprised I like even remembered how to do that properly at all. They're so cool. I feel like it makes my face look so much more interesting. Maybe it's just cause it's so different and I'm so used to my eyes being extremely dark. So now onto my hair, which is already basically done because we got a cut, we got it curled, but it's been a few days. So I just have to touch it up with my straightener and my curler and we should be good to go. Now that the hair is done, it looks really good. Now it's time for the earrings. It was a tough decision, but I feel like this will look really cute with the hair. So I'm gonna put these in. They look so good. If you guys like them and wanna shop any of Anna Louise's jewelry, I link them down below so you can check it out. Okay guys, so before we put the pants on, I'm just wearing pants right now. I got a package in the mail of the boots that I ordered from Target. They're Madden Girl or Steve Madden. Here are the boots. Ta -da! I tried these on at DSW and they have like a weird chain on them so I ordered them without the weird chain from Target. I think they're so cute. All right now let's get these pants on. They're a little wrinkly. I tried to straighten them because I don't have a iron. It didn't really work but use your imagination. Okay so now we're gonna go outside take some Instagrams, my G pics. I'm gonna have my mom take them and have her get like a little outfit photo. I'm probably gonna need a jacket because there's snow. I'm gonna go pick one out. 
Oh, you have a shadow of me. Okay. It's so cold out here. <laughs> we have gloves on. We have a jacket. Oh, we that's... have the shirt. Pan. I need the iron. But I don't have an iron. At least one of us is wearing gloves. Do you think I blew up? Does it look good on me? Or should I go back to like brunette? I don't know. I really like it, but I want to know what you guys think. And give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoy glow up videos. And if you're not already subscribed, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Hit the bell notification button because I post new videos every Saturday at 3 p.m. EST, 12 p.m. PST. Also, if you like the jewelry that I showed, make sure you guys check out Anna Louise's site. I linked it down below. And I'll either see you in my next video next week or my previous video, which you can click at the end. I love you guys so much. Bye!